Welcome to this video. Today our objective is to find measures of angles of triangles. We're going to start with the triangle sum theorem and it says that the sum of the measure of the angles of a triangle is always 180 degrees. If we were to take all three of these angles here, A, B, and C, they would add up to 180 degrees. Let's use the triangle sum theorem to set up an equation and solve for x. In this case here, all three of these angles add up to 180. So 45 plus x plus 30 equals 180. And then just simplifying, 45 plus 30 is 75. And then subtracting 75 from both sides would leave us with x equals 105. So we can use the triangle sum theorem to find missing angles. Let's talk about the triangle exterior angle theorem and it says the measure of each exterior angle. So in this diagram here, angle 3 is an exterior angle equals the sum of the measures of its two remote interior angles. So in this case here, angle 1 and angle 2 are remote interior and the word interior means inside so that makes sense and remote just means away from the exterior angle. They're the two angles that don't form a linear pair with the exterior angle. So if we add these two together, they would equal this exterior angle here. Let's do a visual proof of this. If we were to copy and move angle one so it lines up with this exterior angle and do the same with angle two and then of course with angle two I would need to flip it so that it would fit inside there. You can see that these two angles when we copied them and pasted them over here they fit in perfectly into this exterior angle. Putting in some numbers 45 plus 95 equals 140. Now let's use this to set up an equation. In this triangle here let's solve for x. So using what we just learned we know that these two angles here add up to this exterior angle so we can write our equation as 60 plus x equals 110 and then subtract 60 from each side that leaves us with x equals 50. Now let's apply what we've learned to find three missing angles. You can start in a lot of different spots. There isn't one perfect way to do these. I'm going to start this one with the fact that the two remote interior angles add up to this exterior angle. It just happens to be that the exterior angle of this triangle here is within this triangle but this still is an exterior angle to this right here. So if I were to add these together 30 plus 50 equals y and then simplify well then that means that this exterior angle here is 80 degrees. I'm going to replace that y with 80. Now hopefully this jumps out at you. I have a linear pair. I'm going to use that now to solve for x. I'm just going to do 180 minus 80 and of course 180 minus 80 equals 100 so x equals 100 and I'm going to replace this x and substitute and put this 100 instead. We have one angle left, angle z. Now I'm going to use the triangle sum theorem. Well these three angles here add up to 180 degrees so I'm going to set up an equation. 35 plus 80 plus c equals 180 and then simplify. 35 plus 80 is 115 and then if I subtract 115 from both sides that would leave me with z equals 65. So applying what we've learned I was able to use it to find three missing angles. I'll see you guys in class. As always, this has been a lot of fun.